Yo, what is up, everybody? Watt the Below 70 here, and welcome back to a brand new Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel video. And in today's video, I'm going to showcase to you guys how to play on the same account across of all the devices so that you can play the same account on your computer, phone, Nintendo Switch, Xbox, PlayStation, all those platforms. This is how you're going to be able to do it. So the first step in being able to share your Master Duel account across every platform is you first need to make a Konami account by going to my.konami.net. If you already have a Konami account, like if you play Duel Links, then you'll need to find that username and password and you can test it out by logging in. Or if you don't have an account whatsoever, you're gonna have to click register and then fill out all this information right here. As you can see, I already have a Konami account. So just to test it out, I can log in right here. And as you can see right here, I'm able to log in through this Konami account right here. So my Konami account is good to go. And once you either verify that you have a Konami account or you make a new one, go back to Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel on the platform that you've been playing on first and making progress on. I've been making progress on the Steam version of Master Duel. This is where I made all my progress on so far. So this is where I'm going to connect my Konami account through is this one first. You're going to want to do it this way so that you don't mess up any of your progress that you've made so far while playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel. So you're going to want to do it on the account that you have been playing so far. And before you connect your Konami account to your Master Duel account, make sure to remember this Duelist ID here. Here so that you will know that you're using the correct duelist ID when you connect your master duel account to other platforms so the first thing to do to connect your master duel account to your konami account is you're going to go to the sub menu here and you're going to go to data transfer once you go to data transfer it's going to pop up a screen right here showcasing a qr code and a link since i've already done this i don't need to type in my account right now because i've already connected my steam account to my konami account but if you have not connected your Yu-Gi-Oh! master duel account to any platform any platform like steam iOS, Google Play, Xbox, PlayStation, Nintendo Switch. If you haven't done that, it's gonna pop up a QR code and a link for you to type in. You can go to the link by typing it in, or if you have a device that can scan the QR code, you can scan that QR code, and then you'll be able to be taken to a website where all you gotta do is log into your Konami account and then verify your Konami account through a six digit code that it sends to you to your email. And that is gonna be how you're gonna be able to link your Master Duel account that you're making progress on to a Konami account. Now, this is how you connect your Master Duel account to other platforms that you, so that you can resume progress that you made on one platform onto another platform. Okay, I'm gonna showcase to you guys how to set up your Konami account slash Master Duel account on my Nintendo Switch here since I haven't linked my account on my Nintendo Switch here. And I kinda wanna play the game mobily since the mobile version of this game is not out yet but don't worry this tutorial should work once the mobile versions come out into the game trust me and first things first before i showcase to you how to do it right here what you need to make sure on is that you've made no progress on the new platform so for example um after downloading master duel on my nintendo switch i didn't start the game i didn't go through the tutorial i didn't do anything like that and you don't want to do that because you don't want to make no progress and you don't want to accidentally link a different account on a different platform override your old one you know what i'm saying you don't want to do that so what you're gonna first do is after you just downloaded the game on the new platform here i only downloaded master duel. i haven't done anything else you're gonna log into the game that you just set up okay so once you load it in on master duel right here don't click a to continue on to the tutorial and make sure on the top left that it shows a player id with zero 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 and you know the rest of them are zeros what you're first going to want to do is on the bottom right you'll see a menu icon so click whatever button is corresponding with your platform of choice i'm on the nintendo switch here so i just gotta click the plus button on my switch here but if you're on mobile you just click it on your screen if you're on xbox there's like a circle button with three lines and then i think playstation has like a weird i don't know vertical looking button that's also a three line button that you click to open up the menu here and once you click the menu right here you're gonna want to click data transfer right here so what you're gonna want to do it's the same thing as setting up your konami account with your master duel account but this time around you're doing it the opposite way so now you're transferring that account onto your device by going through the QR code and link. As you can see right here, I haven't done this before on my Nintendo Switch, so I have a QR code here, and I got a website that I gotta type into. And what you do is that you just type in that link that they give to you or scan that QR code and then log in through your Konami account here. So I'm gonna type in the link to here real quick. And then what it's gonna do, it's gonna ask me for my password. Once it asks me for my password, now the game's gonna say that the transfer is complete. We're going to switch over to my Nintendo Switch right here, and it says transfer setting is complete. So once I log into the game now, it's now going to show my player ID that I had on my Steam account of the game. As you can see right here, 046734178. By the way, add me a master duel if you haven't already. And now when I click play, I don't need to go through the tutorial. I just got to accept the terms of service on the new platform that I'm playing on, because since it is on a different platform, you still got to accept the terms of service. But then it's going to allow me to log in the game as normal. I'm going to need to download a little bit here since I 
haven't downloaded any data yet. But uh, yeah, I'm going to be able to download this stuff on this game. And oh my God, I did not realize how mad the, la the Switch lags on this game. Holy. <laughs> But as you can see right here, I am loaded in on the Nintendo Switch right here. So I got all my progress that I made so far on here, which is awesome. And you have all the progress that I did make on my Steam version of Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel is also on this. So I have the same level. I got the same, you know, account and everything like that. All the cards that I've earned is also the same. Like we're big chilling right here. Only thing to keep in mind though, I was really confused about this as I just linked my Nintendo Switch account. So my gem account compared to Steam and compared to uh, the Nintendo Switch is different, but I found out apparently if you pay for gems in this game and you get paid gems from this game specifically, apparently paid gems can be only used on the platform Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel you purchase. So that is why my gem count is different. So by the off chance that you did spend money to get gems in this game like I did, you're going to see that your gem count's not going to be the same on all platforms and you can only spend gems through that one platform only which is something really interesting but another thing that's really interesting though is that i logged into my playstation plus account in order to get 50 uh packs legacy packs but those are still on this account too so again it looks like only paid gems are going to be the only thing that is going to look different from your account but other than that all the progress is the same i made sure to test to make sure that this game's crossplay is working properly where i made progress on my steam version of the game by doing a duel in the absolute monarch campaign and i and i did do a duel to complete everything right here and everything looked the same. So I'm going to go do a duel real quick and complete this little duel right here where I use my starter stack against um, the Monarchs. And I'm going to make sure that the progress I made on here will also transfer over to my Steam version of the game. So I'll be back real quick. Okay, so I'm dealing the final direct attack against the true Monarch here. Let's see if the progress that I made from this will transfer over to the Steam version too. Oh my God, the Nintendo Switch took so long to get the life points to zero. Oh my God. But as you can see, I got a little bit of level up and my duel is complete. So let's see if it's also the same on my Steam version of the game. Okay, so we're back on the Steam version of this game. This game's looking a lot nicer on here compared to the Switch, that's for sure. And I got all my paid at gems, baby. But let's go to the solo mode. Let's go to the Absolute Monarch and let's see if my thing is clear on the top right. Hey, would you look at that? It is the only thing I need to complete is just this right here. And then I am good to go with this whole thing. But yes, it does look like your account completely shares. And that is awesome. So yeah, I hope this video did get help you guys out on connecting your Konami account with your Master Duel account. It does have a cross save also. So whatever progress you made on one platform, you'll be able to continue that on another platform. So if you like playing Yu Gi Oh Master Duel on Steam, but you need to play a little bit of Master Duel on the go, well, you can just play it on your phone or your Nintendo Switch. And then whatever progress you made on those mobile devices, you can bring it back to Steam and vice versa. It is awesome that this game is on all sorts of platforms, and I'm so happy about it. If this video helped you guys out, make sure to leave a like on the video down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel content. That's going to do it for me, though. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next Master Duel video. Have a good one, everybody.